Here I have a uh, little um, quick um, attach plate for a tripod that I designed. Uh, I took the stock one from my Targus tripod I got right here and it's a Targus TG-P60T. This is a cheap tripod that uh, I got this at Walmart. I'm sure other stores sell it as long as you as well as you can get it on like eBay in other online stores these were inexpensive um they're not meant for any you know super heavy duty um more like you know your little point and shoot cameras um your small camcorders um i have put my dslr on here but i wouldn't recommend putting you know a dslr with like a 500 millimeter f1 point something lens that weighs a ton i would not recommend it with that um but i have used my dslr on here with the uh the kit lens the 18 to 55 millimeter no problem but uh, i'll show you here at work and here's the the factory quick attach plate it goes on snaps on it has a little bit of play in it and uh, the cool thing about this plate is it will fit in any direction. It actually has a little less play if you put it on sideways. But um, here's the one that I designed. And I just took my digital caliper, measured everything out. And uh, it's pretty close to similarity to the original. It's, uh, it does actually fit a little snugger. As you see, you have to give that a push. But uh, the re I got it snug. Is my intention is to take uh, to make this thing look nice. I'm going to take some sandpaper. To <coughs> oh, excuse me, to get rid of the the lines from the 3D printer because I printed this in draft. There was no need to print this in the fine. But uh, you just give it a little push. I mean, you ain't having a wrench on it. It, uh, it fits in there, but I am going to be taking a little bit of sandpaper to it. And uh, if you download this and print it out yourself, you'll see it's it, it fits nice. I mean, you don't have to wrench on it. It just has a little extra snugness. And you do a little tiny bit of sanding. Uh, we're talking maybe like five minutes to sand this thing out, make it look nice and smooth, and you'll be good to go. Um, also, on the hole for the mount, and this is a quarter inch by 20 thread screw. What I did is I made the hole just a little small enough so that you can take and uh, thread it. Um, if you don't want to do that, you can just take you know your drill and put a quarter inch bit in there and drill it out or you could just take a screwdriver and uh you could actually use the screw to thread this beans it is plastic that would work but i have a tap and die kit so i just went ahead and used that and the reason i i threaded it is in case um the screw i had is actually comes out just a tiny bit taller than the one on this plate and what I figured is um, if you screw it in you know some things the mount you're screwing to it's not deep enough to take the, all the threads by doing it this way you could tighten it up and it would still hold tight and not flop around and you don't have to run the screw all the way up all right for the file Look in the description below. Um, I have it on Thingiverse. So um, you know you're not going to be downloading something with uh, a virus in it. No, don't worry. It's it's a good file. And like I said, I designed this myself. I just took my digital caliper, measured it out. The only difference is I didn't put in that little holder there. That um, this thing right here that keeps keeps it from twisting but um you should be good and i did leave a little indent in here so that if maybe if you have a lathe or you can also use your drill press if you're careful and use a file 
and figure out where that goes. Um, so if you do drill it out and you're not threading it like I did, you can put a little C-clip in there so that the screw doesn't fall out. And that's for if you drill it out, like I said. And also, um, I would recommend putting some cork on here. Um, I am going to do that. I'm actually out of cork. Um, I've used it for some other camera mounts I've made recently. I'm out of it. I ordered some. It's coming in the mail. It hasn't showed up yet. But I will be cutting that uh, piece of cork and uh, probably just use some super glue to hold it on here. So, all right. With that, that's the plate. It fits. It works perfect. Um, like I said, sand it a little bit. It won't fit as snug. It'll fit more like the original. Um, otherwise, you don't have to. I mean, you're not going to ruin anything. It is a tiny bit snug but it's not going to hurt anything. Don't worry. Um, you could give it a little shot of um, some silicone spray to lube it if you're worried about, you know, having to push on it just that tiny bit to seed it. But all right. With that, uh, once again, look in the description below. Thingiverse files are on there. Thanks for joining us here today. Um, hope you have a great day. And uh, well, after you print this out, uh, have fun using it on your camera or camcorder.